Hi, in this video of playing around with uh, 18650 cells and um, the do-it-yourself power walls, I'm going to talk about uh, bulk charging and bulk discharging. So this is what uh, we're going to talk about today. So these are the charger boards, the discharger board, the resistors, the micro USBs and of course the 18650 cells. So the charger boards, they look like this. As we can see here, we have the micro USB terminal. When we put in a micro USB connector, it powers up um, the board. If we do not want to use the micro USB connector, um, let's say we want to uh, make a bulk charge um, charger, then we do not want to use this, but we are going to use the plus and minus connector over here to connect 5 volt uh, DC current to this board. If uh, we have connected it, uh, we can on the other side connect the battery. So this is the charger, so we want to connect it, of course, to the battery. Battery positive, batteries, battery minus. These units, um, when I bought them, they were about one dollar each. I've looked up uh, on uh, eBay, on AliExpress, and today you can buy them for 30 to 40 cents. Yeah? Um, when you buy them, please be, make sure that it's this uh, layout you find on the board because this is the 2016-2017 version of uh, the TP4056 um, otherwise when you see less components it will be the older version which has uh, none of the temperature control so now when a battery or the board itself is overheating uh, it will uh, cut the power and stop working. The older ones, they do not have uh, the safety circuit. So, um, for the 5 volt input, input um, I've told you, you need a uh, micro USB. So, you just connect them like this and you have power. This uh, discharging board, or also called uh, capacity checker, is also uh, relatively cheap. It's about uh, six dollars. Um, and the word says it, you can check the capacity of a battery. Yeah? Uh, the range goes from 1.2 to 12 volts. So for our um, 18650 cells which uh, range from 3 to 4.2 volts uh, there's no problem to use it. Included when you buy them in the package are resistors something like this one. Um, a resistor like this it's um, a 5 watt 7.5 uh, ohms it will do about uh, half an amp um, in the voltage that we use. First of all, we need power. So we put the 5 volt US micro USB connector in here. Uh, opposite to the charging board, we do not have uh, connection points or easy connection points to uh, put the plus and the minus. Of course, if you disconnect this one, you would be able to put a uh, positive and negative wire in there. But I think it's easier when you take these micro USB connectors, put a lead on it and then uh, connect it to the 5 um, volts DC uh, power supply that you have. So, when we have power, we want to um, connect the battery. So, the 
inside two terminals. They are for the battery positive and negative wire. The two outer connectors, they are to connect the resistor in the in there. So something like that. So the two inner is for the battery, the two outer is for the resistor. Once you have that in place, you can actually charge the bat uh, sorry, discharge the battery. On the other side, we have three LEDs and we have uh, the little display and three buttons. The first LED will blink when it is uh, showing how many amp hours or milliamp hours it has taken out of the battery. So it will be, let's say, um, when there's a value of 2000 on here, it will be 2000 milliamp hours or 2 amp hours. When the next LED blinks, it's the amperage. That's um, the amperage of the resistor with this, which is in here uh, will be translated to an amperage value on the display. So when there's uh, let's say 0 0.53 then we have uh, 530 uh, milliamps which has uh, which is the resistance of uh, the resistor. When we go to voltage, when that blinks, it will show, let's say, 3.78 volts. Yeah? Just showing the voltage at that moment. When the cyclus of de discharging has finished, it will show only the amperage hour um, value. So, for example, it will say 2233 milliamp hours. Yeah, so you know that will be the capacity of your cell. We also have three buttons the OK, plus, and minus. These are used to set the minimal voltage value uh, of the discharger. So you can say uh, when we want uh, an 18650 to discharge until uh, 3.6 volts, let's say for storage, it can do that. But for measuring the capacity, we will um, go down to 3 volts. So it will discharge from 4.2 till 3 volts. I would like to advise that if you want to make a bulk charger board, use these little guys very cheap easy to install uh, and they work fairly good this charger board by these units and then your batteries uh, will be happy so this is my um, discharger and charger board I have uh, 16 chargers as you can see, they are all welded positive negative, so I do not use the micro USBs on there. When I put a cell in there, and it does not change color, so it remains blue, then um, it means that the cell is fully charged. When I put one in and it turns red, then that means that the cell uh, is charging. So it will be charging and when it's finished it also turns blue. This one is my um, converter. So it takes um, the 12 volt from uh, my main supply, power supply, to this one. So this is a 12 volt lead and out comes a 5 volt lead and this is I thought uh, 30 amps. So I have enough. Okay, on the discharger side, when we put in a battery, 
It displays the voltage, 4.11 volts. 4.01 volts. 4.09 volts. So, if we click the minus button, we can see P03.0. Now we can raise that number to 3.6 or more or decrease again. I want um, my cells to be di discharged to 3.0. When I click OK, it's starting. So maybe I'll do that again. When we push minus we have 3.0, we can go up, we can go down. Yeah, But uh, be careful, for the lithium-ion uh, 18650 cells, I would recommend, recommend to go um, to 3 volts the lowest. Yeah? But these other measurements are for other uh, chemistry batteries. Okay, so this is also starting. When we look here at the LEDs, you see that they are blinking, but you also see that they are changing uh, from position. So when it's blinking at the first LED, it's amp hours, we can see 0 0.012 amp hours, so 12, 13 milliamp hours. When it goes to the next one, it's amperage. The value is 0 0.580, so that means we have five, uh, almost half, no, more than half uh, an amp, so 0.58 amps or 580 milliamps. When it goes to volts, 4.0 I just saw, you, he just uh, shows the value uh, on that moment. So of course it will decrease because this one is already at 3.96 volts and has already uh, taken out 40 uh, milliamp hours from that cell. So uh, when that continues um, you will see at the end that it's not the LED which is blinking, but the, the little uh, display which will blink and that will show the final uh, milliamp hours which have uh, come out of the battery. If you think this uh, video helped you uh, understanding more about charging, discharging, uh, separate units or bulk charging um, then please don't forget to like this video and subscribe to my page thank you bye